on this 2010 Prius. So there's the lower fitting right there. And I sprayed bubbles on it for looking for a leak. And the bubbles do not find anything. I also have UV dye in the system that now you can see in the sight glass, it's glowing. That's the UV dye. And the UV light finds nothing. There's no uh, leak by the UV light. So that's a fail. That's a fail this time. The leak detector when I get it there it goes the leak detector when I get it in the right position finds the leak and so in this situation the leak detector finds the leak it's not long enough for the UV lights to find the leak for the dye and it's not big enough for the bubbles to see it visually or appear this is the winner this time sometimes this is the winner sometimes this is the winner sometimes the ultrasonic leak detector is the winner so here's a situation in real life where these two methods don't work this one works right now for an instant check over the long term dye will come out of there and you'll be able to spot it with uv dye okay that's about it oh let me show you some bubbles now that we can see with the UV light some people will want to see what does UV light look like in the sight glass when it's really really low so let's get over here that's what the bubbles look like okay you can see the gas and the liquid that's what happens to what it looks like when there's UV light shining on it. And there's more powerful source of light. Oh look, it almost looks like it wants to fill up. Okay. So that almost looks like a sight glass that wants to fill right now. Now, let's give this a minute. Now it's gonna stay. This must be super, super, super low. And we are still operating at negative three vacuum on the low side. So I'll get off to the next one. I gotta get moving because this vehicle has struts to be put onto it and I'm holding them up taking videos here so I'll let the guy have his vehicle so he can throw struts on it and uh, we'll take care of this leak down here all right guys see ya yeah low side safety switch no doesn't work don't believe what you read Toyota manual knows nothing 